Hey, what's up, guys? Julian from Avalanche Youth, man. God bless you guys, man. I'm just so, so overwhelmed how good God is. I'm here working on my new new message that, that God has been giving me, and it's it's a message that just wows me, man, and, and, and the grace and the mercy of God, man, and it's amazing. But I have to share a little word with you guys first because I feel like a lot of people... You know, need a good word to, to, to keep going and, and their struggles and, and, and make sure that that they know Jesus. So I'm going to give a, a, a small word today and I hope it blesses you. I hope it impacts you and, and, and let God take control of your life, man, because that's the best thing we can do. So if you can open your Bibles to uh, Matthew chapter 14, verse 27, and it goes like this. But Jesus spoke to them at once. Don't be afraid, he said. Take courage, I am here. Then Peter called to him, Lord, if it's really you, tell me to come to you walking on the water. Yes, come, said Jesus said. So Peter went over the side of the boat and walked on the water toward Jesus. But when he saw the strong wind and the waves, he was terrified and began to sink. Save me, Lord, he shouted. Oh, man, this is deep. So basically, the, the revelation that God was giving me is that sometimes in our life, we, we, we doubt God or we ask God questions or we ask Him why we're going through this and, 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 and we're so good in our path to God, but then we shift away a little bit. And like he said, those strong winds started coming in, our strong winds, whatever we go through, our struggles start coming in and they start taking over us and they start affecting us. And what happened, we begin to sink. And that's what happened to Peter. He, he lost his focus for a second on God and, and, and on Jesus. And, and Jesus said, yes, it's me. Come. Come to me, Jesus said. All the strong winds, all the troubles you're going through, the struggles, um, anything you're going through, give them to me. But us, we, we depend too much on ourselves. And we say, you know what, we can do things on ourselves. And that's a, it's not supposed to be like that. So what happens, we start sinking into the water and we start sinking to a hole that we never been through we start sinking through through a, a, a trouble or or a, a tribulation that we never been through we don't know how to handle it you know sometimes we, we we put other things first in front of god and and god says you know what i'm gonna take it away for a while so you can know that so i so you won't sink you won't sink even further down the the water and, and you don't have to drown because that's the last thing God wants us to do is drown us in our problems and drown us in our struggles. That's the last thing. He's saying, put all your faith on me. Put all your, your, your troubles on me. I, t I took those, those tribulations. I took those struggles, the pain you're suffering. I took them on the cross so I can give you freedom and give you the, the peace that you need. And I'm telling you, brothers and sisters, that, that that's what we need. We feel that we sink sometimes and... and and we don't know we're drowning ourselves in this in this in this water, whatever water we're sinking in, whatever problem. It could be financial, it could be um relationships, it can be it could be uh, disobedience to your parents or struggling with a sin, with robbing or, or fornicating or adultery or, or anything. You know, we sink into these problems and we just give in and give in, but God, what happens? God comes out, he reaches his hand and says Give it all to me. Have faith in me. Have have um, um courage in me. And I will take it away from you. I will handle these problems for you in my time. In my and, and, and whenever I want to bless you. That's what he's telling you guys. He's telling me that just put everything in him. Don't don't sink. Don't lose your focus. Don't drown yourself in problems. Because all we have to do is put our trust in in our effort and everything we do in Christ. And you'll see that God will put everything up back to places. Back to place. And, and he just, it's all in his time and it's all in his, you know, God is so good. That's how good he is, man. That he died on the cross for you. So you wouldn't be able to drown. So you wouldn't be able to sink into your hall. So you can have a, a spirit of, of, of self-dominion and, and, and courage and all that. Like it says in 2 Timothy, man. And that's what God wants to speak to you today. That stop drowning yourself in the same problem stop sinking yourself give yourself to me give yourself to me and i will i will i will lift you up of that water like never before stronger like never before just give me everything give me everything that that you're going through 
And you'll see that God, God is there. God is so good, people. God can 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 turn the the impossible to a possible. You have to have faith, no matter what you're going through right now, no matter what struggle you're going through. Jesus will never fail you. I'm telling you, He will never fail you, never fail you. His love is unconditional. His love goes beyond any love you will find. His grace and mercy is 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 abundant, man, and it's just amazing. When you have Jesus in your heart and you're going through a problem, you know that everything's going to be okay. Because Jesus, Jesus just fills that void in your heart. He fills you when you're drowning. He's there to pick you up and save you. He's your lifeguard. He's your lifeguard when you're drowning. God, my God, God is speaking to somebody. He is your lifeguard when you are drowning, when you need it the most. He is there like Peter. Maybe we lose our focus. In some time of an area, maybe we lose our, our, our courage in some time. But that's okay because we all go through it. We all have to go through through an obstacle to see how great, how 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 great the love of God is. And I'm telling you, brothers and sisters, I'm in with you. I'm here in the battle. I'm not saying I'm a per I'm not, I'm perfect, but I'm there with you. But I put my trust in God and I know everything will fall into place again. And I know who 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 wins my battles and I know who's gonna who prospers after all this? I know that my God is amazing. So I'm telling you guys, don't sink in your problem. Don't drown yourself in the same problem over and over. Guys, I'm telling you, put everything in Jesus and you'll see that He will He will fix it. He will fix anything you're going through. Oh man, God is so good. God bless you guys, man. It's a short word, but I hope it impacted you or helped you because... God just it's just so good. God bless you guys and I'll keep you updated on, on everything and, and and just God bless you guys. I love you guys and 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 I'll, I'll see you guys around and God bless man.